The movement of water flowing through a water pipe can be compared to the movement of electrons flowing through a conductor, that is, the flow of electric current. It is water flowing through the pipe, whereas it is electrons flowing through the conductor. A pressure difference is required for water to flow through the water pipe. For example, it should be flooded with a water pump so that water can flow through the pipe. In a similar way, a force is necessarily needed for current to flow through the electrical circuit. If this force is not present, the free electrons cannot move, meaning that the electric current does not flow. Here, the force that causes the electric current to flow through the circuit by moving free electrons is called voltage. The voltage unit is volts. It is briefly denoted by the letter, V, or, E. Definitions of current intensity, voltage, voltage, and resistance units according to Ohm's law. By using the Ohm's law formula and its units, we can define current intensity, voltage and resistance units. A unit of current intensity, ampere, if the voltage between the two ends of an Ohm resistor is a volt, the current intensity passing through this resistor is called an ampere. A unit of voltage, voltage, if the current intensity passing through a receiver with an Ohm resistance is an ampere, the voltage between the two ends of this receiver becomes a volt. A resistance unit, OHM, if the voltage between the two ends of the receiver that draws an ampere of current is a volt, the resistance of this receiver becomes an ohm. Calculation of voltage current resistance formula. A voltage or voltage, electric potential difference, is a force that moves electrons against the electrostatic field force in which they remain under the influence. Another definition, the potential difference between the two ends of a conductor. In order for current to flow through the electrical circuit, a force is required. Without this force, free electrons cannot move, electric current does not flow. The force that causes the electric current to flow through the circuit by moving free electrons is called voltage. The voltage unit is volts. The voltage symbol is briefly denoted by the letter V or E. In multi-phase systems, interface voltages are denoted by U, and phase neutral voltages by V. Direct current generators, batteries, batteries, and their groups, generally have a voltage of 1.5 to 110 V. The effective voltage of alternating current energy used in homes is 220 volts, and the voltage of alternating current used in industry is 380 volts. As the tension increases, the life safety of the person under the influence of the tension decreases. High voltage is difficult to isolate. Because of this, the energy voltage that can be used in practice is between 110 to 380 volts, which is called low voltage and the operating voltage of all kinds of electrical devices.